let me think about it. Ah, <laughs> this one drives me crazy. Let me think about it. I'm gonna think about it. This objection can get tricky. Do they really need to think about it? Or are they afraid they're just gonna hurt your feelings? I think most of the time they are they feel literally like they're gonna hurt your feelings, so they kinda wanna tell just a little a little white lie, right? That maybe you didn't bond for some reason. Uh, the pricing that you discussed is just way out of whack. Or maybe even your terms were you know, questionable. But instead of them saying, hey, yeah, it's just out of our price point, doesn't make sense, we don't wanna move forward, or we really don't feel comfortable working with your company, or yeah, the terms that you're coming up with just don't, yeah, don't sit with us well, so we'd like to explore other options, which, another video altogether. Let me go back 15 years. Customer would call, I'd run right out there, sometimes even leaving dinner. Hey, I gotta go get this one. Need to put food on the table, right? And I'd get out there and I'd, it's what we call the tap dance, and I'd tap dance and I would sell enthusiastically. I just knew that I could convince them. And then after all of that, they would tell me that they were gonna think about it. And I would believe them. Absolutely, but why would they lie to me? All right, they're gonna think about it. So I'd go home and I'd tell the wife, hey, they're, they're just thinking about this one. Feels good, got it locked down, gave them a great price. You know, I bet they'll do it next week. And nothing happens. Don't hear from them, they go into the Witness Protective Program. Well, if I'm gonna get out, I'm gonna think about it. I wanna talk about that expectation before I go and see them, so I'd much prefer to do that over the phone. And we can talk about consultation fees, and, and it's one of those things, if you've got a buttload of, of leads coming in, consultations make sense, but maybe if you don't have a lot of work going on, that might change things a little bit, but you still need to have an open, honest, candid conversation with the client to see what's gonna happen next. So, use a little word track like, all right, say you need to think about that makes sense so one more question if you got a few minutes let's say for instance I'm standing in your space and I bring up these same numbers I design everything that you want everything makes sense we explained it you're on board your significant others on board what's gonna happen next just wait don't say anything see what's gonna happen Because if everything's on point and they tell you you're gonna think about it, well, maybe they are being honest with you. Maybe they're not. Maybe they're scared to tell you the truth. So you just need to confirm that. Hey, when I'm standing in your space and I share these same numbers with you, and the concept's all on point, the design's on point, we're all on the same page. If you tell me you're gonna think about it, I respect that. I want to give you an ample amount of time. But I feel like if you need to think about it, maybe, just maybe, I didn't share enough information with you to make a buying decision. So, what kind of information do I need to share with you to make sure that you don't need to tell me that you need to think about it when I'm in your space? Because we can talk about numbers here over the phone, we can bracket it, we can get real close. Because at the end of the day, I want to make sure I'm protecting your time. And if you need to speak with other contractors, that's fine too. But I don't want you to give me, I'm gonna think about it because that's really a slow no. And I'm gonna do my job, I'm gonna call you up, I'm gonna send you emails, I'm gonna come by and knock on the door, say hello. Because you're still thinking about it, so I assume that I must need to convince you. So, when a customer gives you, I'm gonna think about it, bring up some things like, hey, what is it that you need to think about? Maybe I can help you through that process. Sometimes this can be daunting and maybe I can share a little more information with you to make this process easy for you. How can I help with that? 
go to where they're at. Get them to the point where they have to tell you whether they're being honest with you or not so that you don't spend all your time running around town, tap dancing in the backyards, lying to your significant other, because you really are. You're lying to them because you think you're going to get the job. So find out first. When they say, I'm going to think about it, ask them how you can help them through that process and make a buying decision. There you go.